there is a possible third hypertrophy stimulus. Now we know the first two, mechanical stress or tension, which is putting tension across fibers and metabolic stress, which is stressing our metabolic system. However, the third one, is muscle damage. Now, the reason why this is only a potential hypertrophy stimulus is because people often confuse muscle damage with muscle soreness. So when we think about a beginner in the gym, they are generally going to get really sore from not doing a lot of either mechanical uh, tension-based movements or any sort of metabolic stress. However, you get an experienced lifter or an experienced exerciser and they could do the same thing and they're going to have less muscle soreness. But does that mean less muscle damage? I guess if you have, you have to look relative to their intensities. If they're doing this exact same exercise, the experienced person may not produce muscle damage. However, relative to if we you know push them to a portion where it's going to be hard and challenging, they may not get the muscle soreness, but ideally they still get the muscle damage and the little micro tears that are going to help produce hypertrophy. Important to understand though, is this a byproduct? Is it something that's necessary or is it just really about putting tension on fibers and creating mechanical stress? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below.